We're really excited there's already over 300 collaborations between Australia and India. It can only get better. India and Australia have a broad educational relationship, a knowledge partnership. It spans many different areas, from Indian students studying in Australia through to research collaborations in both countries. Through collaboration, both countries can gain immensely from each other's uh, past history as well as future technologies. To make sure that we have the mechanisms and programs in place, that ensure that the collaboration, the people-to-people -people collaboration is successful. Collaborations uh, would be the way in the future. And we feel that it is the collaboration which is helping university to become the university for the real world. Scholarships can transform the lives of individuals, communities and nations. Students help transfer knowledge, create people-to-people -people links and help with investment and cultural understanding. We have scholarships both funded by the university and by the Australian government to allow student exchange. So we have scholarships uh, worth about 1.7 million dollars towards research and collaborations and we have scholarships uh, worth about 300 to 400 thousand dollars towards onshore uh, programs. And we, our aim is that these uh, recipients of this scholarship, um, which will be called the Ashok Karana University of Adelaide Scholarship, will uh, contribute to the future development of schooling in India. One of our Australian students has received Prime Minister's Australia Awards. He is working in Bangalore on development of a common law in India in relation to what he has studied as common law in Australia. So people are doing such kind of interesting projects. I'm a part of Terry Deacon Bio Nanotechnology Centre and I feel uh, myself privileged to be a part of such initiative and I see a lot of potential which will help me in taking my career to an international level. Students have had an impact on Australia's understanding of India and vice versa. What people often take away from student exchange is personal transformation and a new way of looking at the world and living their day-to-day -day life. We do want to increase the number of students, academics and supervisors that flow between Australia and India. The Australian students come to India once a year. They spend about three to four weeks and they also do a lot of activities around Bollywood, around uh, socialising, uh, meeting with students. Uh, and actually really studying um, you know, with the Indian uh, group of people here. The both side faculties and researchers are using best uh, technology mediums to, to communicate. We're really excited about the new Australia India Education Links website. Both governments have responded by creating this new site. And we think it will really help our Aussie Institutes to better understand India and vice versa. The Australia India Education website offers a great platform for both Australian institutions as well as Indian institutions to look at each other's trends and identify specific synergies in taking the relationship forward. Having a co-branded website like this will provide authenticity and a single point for information. The portal will serve as an extremely useful resource that carries accurate information to those that want it. The website will provide a better opportunity and platform for more collaborative partnerships. It offers a huge knowledge pool which I truly believe that every student should benefit from. When you collaborate, you form partnerships and when you form partnerships, it brings about engagement. So I think this is going to be a very strong step forward between our two governments. You know very well, coming together is beginning. Keeping together is progress and working together is success. So we've created a website that brings all of this information together, all of this data together on one portal, which allows people to access this information so they can understand just how deep, broad and enduring this partnership is. It's all about talking to each other and getting to know where the opportunities are. Global partners. Global education.